Hey y'all. So Ryan made me take my glove off to start the video. Yeah. My hands are ashy too. Yeah. I, I got yeah. lots of ash going on right there. It's winter y'all. Well, it's still it's autumn. It's still autumn. It's kind of like spring, but fall. it's still autumn. It's but fall, uh, autumn is the same thing. Yeah. It's going to be winter on December 21st. And it is not even December yet. And there's snow on the ground. I showed them that was my last video. That goes to show you don't watch. I do. Well, then you would know. I watch. I forgot. Know. You should the long road home or something like that. You should even, know the, you should even know the title. You should know it. I watch that shit. What's the title? You the should know it. The long road home. You should know it. Don't be saying some. And stop saying that, man. What? Uh, harsh curse words because uh, you, you, you I told so you say it. stop don't you say it again because YouTube is starting to pay attention to me you gotta stop saying those words what words can I say again I already told you look it up I ain't telling you again and y'all can say I'm being mad I don't care I told her like 50,000 50, times already and, and the SH isn't one of them I right. told, don't you watch TV what they say on TV what do they say on TV? What what words they say on TV? And I'm not talking about damn. You. Yeah, you can say damn. Mother, no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I don't even know why you think that's funny. YouTube is um, starting to pay attention, even though uh, you know I'm a smaller YouTuber. They are, they definitely starting to pay attention to me. A lot of my, uh, uh, I got like maybe three or four uh, videos that I just remembered that I did, and they're not there no more. They took them. They took them off. Oh, this stinks. So you you gotta Especially be careful. The helium one that was funny. You gotta you gotta, you gotta be careful, man. What you saying now? Cause they they paying attention to us now. But people get away with some stuff. They have millions of followers. Well, I, the difference is they probably making YouTube money, so they're like, oh, we'll overlook her showing her booty, and we'll yeah. But is it is, is it is it skin? Are they showing skin, or is it just in thongs? Cause that's the difference. You can show as much skin as you want, as long as you're not showing your private parts. You can do that. Wow. Yeah, you can do it. There's not nothing, nothing in a policy saying you can't show your skin, as long as you're not showing private parts. Who else tries to show its skin? I'm just kidding. <laughs> you don't even want to do challenges, and then you get a little upset when I do pranks. What do you mean show skin? Showing skin is different than a prank. Yeah, that's worse. No, it's not. Showing skin. It's skin. Okay. It's not a fear involved or grossing somebody out or something like that. You don't know. You can be grossing somebody out and show <laughs> your skin. That's so rude. I wasn't trying to be <laughs> facetious. I'm talking about, think about all the people That's true. that. Yeah, I'm, you're not, right. I'm not being rude. I'm thinking about people in general. Yes. I'm not trying to be facetious and mean to my wife. I'm just being honest. Nobody want to see me naked either. I want to see you naked. Well, yeah, because we've been married for God knows how long, but those folks... Only God knows how long? You oh, don't know how long? No, I don't know. No. No. Damn. Oh, I didn't say what's up. And y'all ain't going to get it. They ain't going to get what? Oh, what's up? Oh, what's up? Yeah, they're not going to get it. Y'all know who I am. Y'all know. Yeah, it was hot in here, man. I'm trying to burn me out. Do not complain. Just Relax. Relax. Yeah. I didn't say relax. I said relax. Chillax, chillax. So we're going to the store. Oh God, you talking? You just talking random. You just that's what this is it's supposed to be. It is no, random. You just, I didn't write I down a script. I have no idea. You don't, you don't have like stories you can talk no, about. I ain't got no stories. What happened at work all week? People want to hear some. Nothing happened. No. What about the stories you told me about your co-workers? Like you don't want to tell these guys anything. You don't want to tell the people. I have nothing to say about my co-workers. You are. I like them. BSing. What else can I say? They I don't get it. I work, get a, a, I work well, in a company that have great people that I work with. There's really nothing negative to say about them. Other than that, the new ones ask too many questions and oh, they annoy God. you. Yeah. Okay, then you have something to say. <laughs> what the hell's wrong with you? Well, I mean, it's normal. 
Nicole. She acts like she has nothing to say. I don't have nothing to say. Nobody cares about that. That was just like two weeks of annoyance, and I'm over it. So, like, they really just stressed me out for a good. You just told me a week ago. Oh, people just do about their daily lives, and they just talk about anything. So talk about anything. I am. We're going to the store to get some cake. Cause we want cake. I bought a. An apple pie last night. Oh god, I should have never that apple pie. Um, yes, I can bake, but I don't prefer it. Um, but we bought an apple pie. I was all ready for it. Put it in the oven. It's all nice and gooey and crumbly. And I had some vanilla ice cream. And I made myself a plate with it. And then I bit into it. It was instant diabetes. Oh my god! You could tell they added so much extra sugar on that on that thing. That was my story. <laughs> so, do we have any readers out there? What are y'all reading? I'm reading this book. It's by Troy Drayton called The Cobblestone Flower Pot. It's really good so far. It's a fast read, it's only 150 something pages. And um, an excerpt from that was someone's inability to see our worth is not a representation of our value it is merely a reflection of what traits they deem important and i thought that was a pretty good um excerpt from that book because that is very true like people take too much stock into what other people think about them they um don't fully live their lives because they're worried about what somebody else might think or how they look to somebody else like me for example you know I can't dance in the typical fashion that people dance like all these dances that people do I don't know these dances I don't watch music videos I don't go to clubs and stuff so when I go somewhere and dance it's not what everybody else is doing so to some people they may say hi you can't dance even my husband used to say that in the beginning I can't dance guys I've dated in the past said I can't dance well what is dancing like dancing is just moving your body and you're feeling the music and you're doing whatever you want to do. It's not, I don't have to be some organized dance that everybody else is doing. I can do what I want to do. And you know, that's one of those things of not caring about what other people think. Some people don't dance because they can't dance. They won't get out there and dance and live their lives. Well, dance, like it doesn't matter what you're doing. Just move your body. And if somebody wants to shame you for that, well, shame on them. That has nothing to do with you. Go out and live your life. If they want to be put in a little box and judged based on based on what society tells them to do, that's on them. That has nothing to do with you. And uh, I, uh, my wife used to ask me, can you do the Carlton? Because y'all, if y'all know what the Carlton is, it's that white yeah. boy <laughs> dance. I used, I used to, well, I can still do it really well. My wife. <laughs> I used to love him to do it because it's so funny. It's fun, and I used to really get into it. Like, yeah, you know what I mean. So maybe one day I'll do that for y'all when I feel like it. You know, I gotta be in the mood to actually get it, get it in because I yeah. actually could do it pretty well. But yeah, I may show y'all that one day. I'll probably put that on Instagram or something so y'all can see me do that. I probably even do. I probably even try to do the unusual when he he sing the unusual song. You I was just that singing there? that when I was doing this. Yeah, so. <laughs> I may do that for y'all one. Yeah, but my wife is right though. You know, everybody think you gotta be uh you know, you, you, you have to be a choreographer out there on the dance floor, then you doing all the popular dances, then oh yeah, you can dance, but you know, so basically all I have to do is watch videos for the, for two or three days, go out and do the same dances everybody else do. And, and then I that can, means you can dance. I can dance. Yeah. I mean, I, it's one thing if you're doing like the electric slide, Cupid Shuffle, and all those things. Yes, those are the achy, breaky heart. Those are all organized uh, dances. Yes. You want to do those. They're group activity dances. They get you on the dance floor. They get the you going. Achy, electric slide, heart. all that stuff. That's hilarious. But I'm talking about like just your average dancing when you get out there on the dance floor and, you know, people are trying to look sexy doing all this twerk and all this other stuff i'm just out there to have feel good have a good time just do my own thing and i don't care what you're doing that's it like even just just oh i thought that was a real deer <gasps> he's gonna trick many a people but anyway so this book is really good it's like i said it's a fast read i'm gonna finish it i started it last night read 50 pages and um gonna finish it tonight today when we get back to the house we just came out to run some errands 
get some cake. Went to breakfast. Well, went to lunch because it's one o'clock. I've been up since three thirty. I've been up since eight thirty. Now, what yeah. You, what I, you what you now on about? <laughs> I went to bed. I went to bed before midnight. Um, Cause I was so tired. I was trying to stay awake. We watched a movie. We watched Equalizer. Equalizer too. too. Yeah. And I was so tired. It was hard to stay awake. Although the movie was good, it was still hard to stay awake. Then after I that, so I watched. The, after that, yeah, we did. Yeah, we saw Equalizer too. Yeah. 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 And then after that. Alright. Okay. But. Uh, <laughs> um. So then, I was falling asleep. He was watching something else. I was falling asleep, and uh, I was like, gonna read for a little while, went to wash the dishes and all that stuff, thinking I would wake up so we could watch something else together, but I couldn't, I couldn't stay up. I couldn't well, stay you up. did stay up, you just... I got in the bed. Some magazine. I read a magazine, because I have a look, thousand of them. She just be looking at the pictures, y'all. Whatever. <laughs> <laughs> um, I read a magazine, then I read, um, I started this book. Yeah, and then I, I couldn't hold my eyes open anymore. And I and I was getting to the point where I was just reading words on the page and I wasn't really absorbing the information. She's so like, you know what? This book sounds really good and there's a lot of good little tidbits of information here. So I really want to pay attention. So let me take my butt to bed. Aren't you proud I said butt? I said butt instead. <laughs> you should be proud. You can, there's cusses you can say, just not the harsh ones. I'm gonna, see, I'm an all or nothing type of person. No, no, we can't, can't. you can't do that on the videos, I'm telling you. That's what you I'm saying, so I'm gonna try up. to not curse at all because I'm an all or nothing. I can't, I can't not say MF and not say the S or, or if you're gonna say then, it, or if you're gonna say it, put put some pronunciation on it, like that. You know what I mean? So if you're gonna say, go shit. You know what I mean? You gotta be all <laughs> extra with it if you say it. Cause then they go, what did he say? Like you can say that, and you can be like, you mother f <laughs> <laughs> You know what I mean? You can do it that way. Yeah, see, I will never remember to do that. Yeah, do it that way. But if you just come out and just go, mother f you know what I mean? Then they're like, okay, that's blatantly a curse word. But if you put some emphasis on it, then it's not that bad. Yeah, I can't do that. You son of a bitch. <laughs> Oh, imagine having to come out of that hill two days ago. But well, yeah, you gotta put some emphasis on it. Yeah, so I'm gonna just try to do no cursing. Yeah, it's not gonna I'm work. I'm gonna do. It's not gonna work for I'm you. I'm gonna man. try not to curse. Yeah, okay. For real. You'll cuss them. I'm gonna try not to curse. For real. I don't mind if you cuss, just don't say the harsh ones. Who says cuss? Me. Cuss. Hey, you just was over there talking about, you know, who cares what people think. <laughs> and you over here messing with I'm how, judging you. That's how, right. how, how I I'm talk. judging you. That's right. Man, you don't get but your, you're my husband. I can judge you. You don't get your ass out of here. I mean, you can literally get out while I'm driving. <laughs> I love you. Mm-hmm. Love mm -hmm. you, too. Anyway. Yeah, and, and also in this book, it said something about... Um, judging other people's relationships which i thought was also really good oh, Every, and, everybody judges and something in the, the um alchemist i read that earlier Every, everybody this judges. week <sighs> even when you say oh i don't judge everybody judges. yes that is true i i do everybody judges even those who say they don't judge they're judging everybody they're judges. judging they're judging something everybody somebody. judges man everybody yeah I'm trying to think that what i um uh, oh if someone isn't what others want them to be, the others become angry. Everyone seems to have a clear idea of how other people should lead their lives. And that's very true too. Like, so true. There's really not a whole bunch to say about it. Man, you, I mean, you can have a long conversation about people judging. You know, people judge me by the way I act with my personality because I'm so blunt with my words. And then people are also upset with me because they're like, oh, you can't do nothing around him, such and such and such. It's not about you can't do anything around me. It's mm -hmm. about have some respect for, for my space, mm -hmm. have some respect for your space, have some respect for my household. You can do whatever you want to do outside. Just don't do it in my house. Yeah. And that's what it's about for me. Mm -hmm. I understand my wife wants an open, welcoming home, but I don't. <laughs> he does not. I don't. He don't like drop bys. I like that. So you need to call. You need to text. You need to let me know. You need to see if somebody home first. 
You need to see if Ron is not sitting around in his boxer shorts. Yeah, because that's what I do. I sit there with my glasses on, I cross my legs, and I watch TV. With well, his boxer shorts on and socks. And socks. <laughs> And then if I'm reading something on my phone, then, you know, I do the little old man thing. I put my glasses down a little bit. You know, it's just what I do. I'm getting into that age where I'm still crazy, but I'm also fun, but respect my shit. You understand what I'm saying? So, but yeah, you know, you, you, so people have been judging me all my life. Family, friends, and guess what? Whatever. I don't <laughs> judge you though. You know, it is what it is. You know, it's. You know, you got to live your life accordingly to how you see fit. That's right. And as long as you are doing, you know, or if you're a good citizen and you're a good... Productive son, member of society. Good son or good husband or good nephew or good cousin or, or trying to be person. just decent, good human being. And that's all that really matters. Yeah. Who cares? If you having a bunch of fun on YouTube, so what? Just don't mess with nobody. You don't, you know, don't hurt nobody. Don't else. prank your wife. Oh, hell no. <laughs> We're going to prank some wife. We're going to prank some wife. You understand? Some wife? <laughs> We're going to prank some wife. We're going to prank some wife. You know, we gon' we gon' we gon' challenge some wife. We gon' we gon' do all that to some wife. <laughs> <laughs> we gonna do all of that. Oh, you know what I'm saying? I I just want to you know what? I've been in a bubble and I've been so tight for so long. Oh, he's been so just, tight. And trust me, this YouTube thing has just released me from being so tight. Like, I used to be so tight. Like, I didn't want to... I just wanted to be me. I didn't want to come out of my shell. But i always been out of my shell. But now I'm more out of my shell. I don't care what the world says about my videos. I know they're not the best edited videos. They're not the best looking videos. I can be more entertaining. My wife can be more entertaining. But I can't this, be more entertaining. You, you can be whatever you want to be. This is your this choice. This is just me. This is your choice. This, yeah, this, this is, is just your me. choice of yes. being the way you want to be. Period. Yes. It's, so you have nothing to say. Unless so you just I'm not ask, entertaining. So, so you're entertaining. This is just who I am. Tiara says you're entertaining. Thanks, cousin. I love you. We got people out here that watch that watch me and watch you. Period. So you can stop saying you don't have anything for anybody when you do have a lot. You have a lot of people on your Instagram. You, you you are in oh, every, people just be liking every, me so I like them and then they delete me everybody it took me a long time I knew this but it took me a long time to believe it what every single person on this planet is interesting everybody I never believed that before in my life until like the last two or three years ago of my life every single person that has lived through life. I'm not talking about of, you know, you, maybe you can find a four or five year old interesting yes. because of where they talk and how they communicate with you. They, you see but, their brain going? And, and, and you know, they thinking and all that stuff. So they're interesting too. But I believe every single, and that goes for handicapped, that goes for everybody. I believe every person out here that can speak to you or write down or whatever, I believe every single person on this planet is interesting. Whether they're old or young, that's just you know. I never believed that. I just didn't think everybody was interesting. So when my wife says I'm not interesting, I will never believe that in my life. Because I didn't she say is, I wasn't interesting. I said I'm not entertaining. You're entertaining. You can you talking. That's entertaining people. Because if you're not entertaining people, then nobody want to listen to you. Your brothers listen to your conversations. Your mother listen to your conversations. I listen to your conversations. All your that's Instagram, you guys love me. all your Nobody's Instagram, not to come all your to Instagram to followers are listening to your comments, looking at your pictures. That long ass paragraph you say underneath every picture you put, <laughs> people are reading that stuff. So guess what? You are. Do you read it? Yes, I do. <laughs> That's because you are entertaining and you're interested. Interesting. And you know why you're interesting? Because when people start getting emotionally involved, it can be the corniest thing you think it is. But people still going to read it because they have invested their time in you. And that's what I want you to come to realize that stop saying that because once people start investing their time in you, it doesn't matter what you do at all. It matters. It doesn't matter at all. So I want you to get that through your head and let that be a stoppage. 
today. Yes, I said stoppage. Let that be a stoppage today. Stops today. Because you are entertainer in your own way. You are interesting in your own way. I never said I wasn't interesting. I know that. You're not interesting. You suck. You see? Do you see? <laughs> no, I'm joking. What was but, that laugh? I don't know. Let's go. Let's but go get some cake. You calm down because this one right here. Ice cream and she, cake and cake. Ice cream she and is cake a, and cake. a very, Ice cream and cake. very, very impatient person. Oh my God. Y'all know already. Y'all know. So you just hold. Everybody knows. You just. Wow, that's a lot of everybody knows. That's a lot of exposure. Look at it. Saturation. 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 What's, what's a saturation? But yeah, y'all. Um, we that's a little something for y'all. I'll probably throw this video. Well, I will throw this video up today. And I think I got another video I'm gonna post today too. I'm gonna talk to my wife about it as soon as I close this oh, one out. Oh boy. See? And she supports me. I do. You don't you don't support and say oh boy. I don't get off of me. You don't say boy, you don't say oh boy. Boy, boy, boy. That's not support. You don't suppose to go oh boy when you're supporting someone, mm -hmm. y'all. Anyway, we are out. We're gonna close this out. I'm Ron G. This is my wife. Cake. 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 Go ahead, say it five more times. Cake! I'm Ranji. This is Cake. And we out. Bye. Uh, I already took my seatbelt off. Let's go!